to more physics into their dance. And by physics, I mean stuff like gravity and inertia, things like that, um, where, you know, and adding weight to your liquid, as they say. So what I'm talking about is, is uh, you know, if you were to factor in gravity to your liquid, imagine a roller coaster. You know, you're, you're, you're getting pulled up something, uh, pulled up this track get to the top of it, and gravity, once you get to the top and it goes down, it just starts forcing you to go fast. It comes up and you have to go slow again. So while you're going up, you're fighting gravity, and it's slow, and then you're coming down, and it gains speed. That's one idea I play with sometimes. Uh, another one is, is inertia. Inertia can be applied to a lot of things. You can simply just go like this. That's inertia, because there's an energy that you're pretending to create, and you're moving it, and once it hits here, boom, sending it out, but now it's coming back. There's inertia. You can use inertia to create spins. You can be doing your liquid, and you throw your liquid this way really fast. You take your one arm, <coughs> you're flowing, and then you take it this way. Throw it that way real fast. The inertia of that can create a spin. You're adding weight to your liquid. And what I mean by that is that if I'm doing liquid and I throw my liquid up that way, it, it's not just this, this weightless energy that I just can throw around and move around. And it starts to become spastic at that point. But if your liquid has weight, and you're applying physics to it. When you throw those, that weight up in the air, that energy, it's going to have an effect on you, and that effect is going to be in proportion to what you're doing. So if I'm throwing my liquid out this way, the inertia and energy and gravity and all those physics I'm talking about come into play. So when I go do a turn like this, I'm not just doing it because I think it's a cool thing to do. I'm doing it because I'm imagining that if I throw my liquid up this way, and then it's swooping back this way, the inertia and the, the physics of it pulling back is going to force me forward. And when I go down, I'm not just going down because I think it looks cool. I'm going down because I feel like if I had a weighted energy in my hand of sorts, and I bring it down, it's going to, it's going to pull me down and come back up. So. These are the ideas that you should be playing with if you want to get into deeper physics with your liquid.